That is one big stocking. I wonder if something's inside it. Huh? Wait a minute. I think I've stumbled upon some kind of portal. Far out! Huh, I didn't know they made stockings that big. Go big or go home, I guess. Oh, hey, honey. Oh, I didn't know you were hiding in there, babe. Actually, I wasn't. It turns out these large stockings are linked portals. Portals? I've got to see this. See? what I tell you? This is really neat. We got to show this to the others. Good idea. Let's go. When did this get here? And when did they make stockings this big? Hey, we could make good use of it. Let's bring it back with us. Are you sure, Clyde? It's pretty big. What's the worst that could happen? It's only a stocking. So this stocking is a portal leading to another stocking? Precisely. Here, I'll demonstrate. You always find the weirdest things, Clyde. Where'd you even find this? Well, we were just out strolling when we came across it, and Clyde wanted to bring it with us. Yeah, I thought this could be useful. Mainly as some sort of storage sack or something. Well, it sure is a big sa- Ow! Ah, my nose. How did I get here? Pac-Man, you trying to mess with me? What do you mean? It was an accident. Oh, you think you're so clever, huh? You're asking for it now. Uh-oh. Here we go again. Wow, it works. Never mind that, Kirby. I've got to go help Pac-Man. This gives me an idea. Kirby, take this stocking and make sure Pac-Man goes into it. Okay. I hope this works. A power pellet. Come to mama. <laughs> Pac-Man in here! Okay, Kirby. Pac-Man, help me with the stocking quickly. Okay. He went in there. After him. Hey, I'm stuck. I can't see. What's happening? Ow, my nose. That was close. Yeah, but they won't keep in there for long. Babe, I'm here. Where are the ghost monsters? We trapped them in that bin. Well, I came just in time then. You ate a power pellet? Couldn't let those guys hurt you, sweetie. Now let me at them. That takes care of that. Aw, you're my hero. Just as you are mine. I don't want a lot for Christmas. There is just one thing I need. Are you singing that damn song? Oh, come on, Blinky. It's a good song. It's so annoying. No, it's not. Yes, it is. You just don't like it because it gets played all the time. Remember Wonderful Christmas Time? Ugh, please don't remind me. Yeah, you get upset every time that song comes on the radio. That song is too simple. It's too saccharine. And the synth reverb is all over the place. It was made by Paul McCartney, one of the Beatles. Not every Beatles song is a bona fide masterpiece. I know that. But the song is still good. You're just a sucker for any song related to Christmas. No, I'm not. I bet you'd sing the entirety of the 12 days of Christmas if someone paid you. Hell, I bet you'd do it for free. No, I wouldn't. Oh, really? I mean, that song starts out pretty good, but it goes on for way too long. Well, at least you aren't completely crazy. Unlike Surfing Bird. That's not even a Christmas song. I know. But I still like it. Oh, come on! It's the worst song ever! You just don't get it, Blinky. You're too old. We're the exact same age. Oh, yeah. Dang it. 
I don't want a lot for Christmas. Don't you start again, Clyde. Fine. I'm just gonna go watch TV. Damn it, now it's stuck in my head. Alright, now that this batch is out of the oven, I'll just wait a few minutes for it to cool. Wow, freshly baked cookies! Pac-Man, wait! Oh, what is it, Kirby? The cookies have to sit out for a bit, or else they won't hold together. I see. Alright then, I can wait. I'll let you have one once they're ready. Sounds good. Oh boy, cookies. Wait! Clyde, don't! Hey, this cookie's falling apart. Kirby, I don't think you cooked these long enough. Clyde, they have to cool off before they're ready. That's pretty weird, but okay. Are these all the cookies you're baking? No, this is just the first batch. I'm gonna make a lot more after these. Oh, cool. Oh, hell yeah, cookies! No! Don't! Blinky, wait! What the hell is this? It's disintegrating! It hasn't cooled off yet. Hey, this is still good. Mmm, he's right. You know, I'm actually using a special dough to make these. It's actually safe enough to eat raw. Wait, really? Our refrigerated cookie dough is ready to eat raw because we use heat-treated flour, pasteurized eggs, and ready-to-eat manufacturing. Man, screw the cookies. I could just eat this stuff like it's ice cream. Hey, you bring that back. Wait, Kirby. He'll bite you if you get near him. I could chop him if I find a power pellet. Now, Kirby, we wouldn't want to cause a massive stir over this. But I can't just let him eat up all that dough. There's no way anyone other than you two could eat up that whole tube in one sitting. Not even me. Hey, you might be right, Clyde. <sighs> Too much. <sighs> well, that ends that dilemma. Ah, another year, another holiday season. Yeah, I'm quite excited. The lead up to Christmas is always a fun time. You said it, honey. There's so much we can do until the big day. Speaking of which, look at that. Hey, it's mistletoe. What a perfect start. Let's do it. Come on, babe. Merry Christmas. Well, it looks like we're nearing Christmas again. Yep. Christmas may be overly saccharine, but it's still a fun time. Plus, you get presents. Not to mention the parties. Wait, I just remembered something. Hmm, I bet she's got an early present for me. Oh, Blinky. Yes, Pinky? I've got something for ya. Lay it on me then, sister. Surprise! Is that mistletoe? Yep, you know the rules. Merry Christmas, Blinky. <laughs> Thanks, Pinky. I can't believe we're already in December, Inky. This is awesome. Yeah, I, I can I can hardly believe it myself. Last year's Christmas was fun, but I just know this year's will be super fun. Uh, I'm, I'm sure it will be. I can see it now. We'll be nice and cozy, we'll eat lots of fried chicken, we'll eat lots of candy, we'll drink lots of cocoa, we'll sing lots of Christmas songs, we'll watch lots of Christmas specials, we'll watch lots of Christmas movies, we'll play lots of video games, and best of all, we'll be with all our friends. And we'll be able to do all this together, you and me. Uh... <laughs> uh. Oh, you want to do the mistletoe thing? Okay. Merry Christmas, Inky. Well, that does it for that. I don't really know how else to end this little Christmas special of mine, so I guess I'll just leave you off with a few words before I roll the credits. I just want to thank everyone who supported me throughout the year. I'm very happy with what I've been able to accomplish this year, all the cool stuff that's happened to me throughout the year, and all the new friends that I've made throughout the year, and all those who have, you know, stuck with me throughout the year. I can't be thankful enough for that, and I just want to say thank you, and I want to wish all you guys 
a happy holiday season. Merry Christmas, happy Hanukkah, happy Kwanzaa, happy whatever holiday you celebrate in December. I hope you have a really good time with all your friends and family. And I know some of you guys out there aren't doing so well. There's always going to be some sort of trouble in the world. But I genuinely hope you turn out all right. And I hope you'll be able to find some sort of comfort and happiness in this time of merriment and togetherness. But anyways, I thank you very much for watching this video. This is Andrew Ambrose wishing you a happy holiday. And I'll see you all in 2023.